This is MPLS Full Scale Lab. MPLS Full Scale Lab is a company XYZ. It's a service provider network consists of three main regions region X, region Y, and region Z. Region X and region Y are identical. They have two routers function as PE P router. They have two rules PE router for its connected customer routers and P router for its PE routers that are connected to it. PE P routers connected to other routers in different regions. For example, PE P one X its number one in its region and its rule is PEP router and it resides in region X and is connected to PEP1Y, the first router in region Y. Back again to region X where we have PE3X. This router functions as PE router only. It connects customer router and its number three and resides in region X and connected to PE. P1X. As we said, region Y is identical to region X. It has same number of routers and same connections. Region Z, where we have P1Z and P2Z. Two routers function as P router only reside in region Z. It has four PE routers, PE3, 4, 5, 6. PE routers are connected to P routers in the region and they are connected to PE P routers in other regions like PE 3Z, PE 4Z connected to PE P 1X and 2X and same for PE 5, PE 6. All three regions are connected to each other using the core routers, the P routers. P1X is connected to P1Y and is connected to P1Z and same for other P routers. To enhance node length redundancy, there are two planes in each region, plane 1 and plane 2. Another level of protection is added for PEs in each region. They are connected to each other like PE3X is connected to PE4X and same for PE3Z to PE4Z and PE3Y connected to PE4Y. There are three root reflectors. Root reflector 1 resides in region X, root reflector 2 resides in region Y and root reflector 3 resides in region Z. There are three customer branches. Customer A Customer B and Customer C. Customer A has two different branches. The first branch consists of two routers, CE5 and CE6, and they are connected to the two planes of region X. They are connected to PEP1X and PEP2X to enhance redundancy for customer A. The second geographical site for customer A is represented by CE7 and this branch is connected directly to region Z both planes of region Z to PE3Z and PE4Z and it has a direct connectivity to the first branch of customer A site CE7 customer A is connected directly to CE6 customer A this is for more protection and another level of redundancy Customer A required to connect its branches directly with another provider. We have same for customer B. It has the first branch connected to region Y. The second branch is connected to region Z and both branches of customer B has a direct connectivity for more protection via another service provider. Customer C has two separate geographical sites as well and they are connected to region X and region Y. The target of this service provider, service provider XYZ, is to provide connectivity for different customer branches. The 
ENSP file for this lab with the initial configuration files for all these scooters are uploaded in the resources section of this lecture.